Hello YouTube, uh, thank you for tuning in. This is Ambi. Today we will talk about classes and functions. So what are classes? Let's say you uh, you are principal or teacher, you have many classes and in each classes you have students. Um, let's say you are principal and you want to talk to a student, what do you do? Uh, you go to that class and you call that student, right? So basically have that a picture in your head when you think of classes and what are functions now now uh, let's say you have um, mm, uh, you have a story you have a novel right you have a huge novel let's say Harry Potter Harry Potter uh, part one um, and you uh, you want to say if you if let's say tomorrow if um, uh, somebody asks you uh, what did you read today uh, we, then instead of you telling the entire story uh, right, what are the contents of the Harry Potter one? Uh, you just say Harry Potter, right? You tell the name of the book, not the entire content of the book, right? I haven't read Harry Potter, I don't know, but I'm just saying, right? So if you have read a novel or something, then you don't say the entire content of the novel. If somebody asks, okay, what did you read today? You just say the name of the novel. So every time you want to refer to that novel or tell your friends about it, you don't uh, read the entire content of it uh, that will just simply waste the time hours and hours of uh, time just say the name of the novel the same way functions are something where instead of you writing each that piece of code a uh, collection of code every time you give that you envelope or you put all that code uh, uh, or give a name to that code and you just call that uh, name right so what am I talking about let's uh, do that and we will know. So I'm gonna define define def minus define here. I'm defining a function. It's called addition a comma b are the variables that it expects. I'm gonna say return a plus b. So when I say addition two comma three addition 23 comma 24 so this is what happened so this is a function now now let's look at a class 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 superhero I'm gonna say I'm gonna define some variables as well Batman Bruce Superman Clark Right, and I, I will define a function here inside saying self. Um, yes, so uh, I will say self. Uh, what am I? T what am I typing? Self, and I will say return love Batman or Batman forever. Now, let's see what happens. So I will, if I want to use this class, I will first define an object. I will say hero object. Uh, it's just my choice of the name. You can say whatever you want, uh, but you define an object like this. You say superhero, superhero. Yep, now I define an object. Then if I want to use stuff in that object, I will say do like this, Batman, all right, S Superman, all right, hero, I gotta close the parenthesis here, Batman forever. So this is how you do. That's all we had for functions and classes. Sharing is caring. Thank you for tuning in. You have a great one.